a very happy morning my dear children so here we are with our chapter animals and their young ones today we are going to study about frogs fishes and reptiles so come on children let's start first we will begin with frogs so the first step is very normal step we can understand that kahan se starting hoti hai a frog lays a frog lays a cluster of eggs in a safe place in the water cluster means bahut sare eggs okay kya karta hai frog sabse pehle he lays a cluster of eggs the cluster of eggs is called spawn see this is spawn a large number of eggs in water okay now the second step the baby frogs called tadpoles come out of the eggs in about 3 weeks okay if eggs are there then it is obvious that baby will come out and frog baby is called tadpoles so tadpole comes about comes from the egg in about 3 weeks they look like tiny fish and breathe through gills a fish has gills right so see these are the tadpoles see early tadpole then growing tadpole as you can see the shape of the tadpole the shape of the tadpole is like a fish then the tadpoles gradually lose their tails and develop legs hum jab frog dekhte hai to kya uski tail hoti hai nahi hoti hai na so tadpoles are having tail then gradually when it develops it loses its tail and develops legs after a specific period of time they become an adult frog okay they become an adult frog like this and this process of conversion of a tadpole into an adult frog is called metamorphosis see this is the life cycle of frog and see this is the land region as you can see here this is the land region adult frog is on the land then a large number of eggs in water it lays egg in water and then tadpoles live in water right they are fish like swimming in water then they convert into an adult frog and see again it comes on land so this was the life cycle of a frog now the parent frogs also take care of their babies but only for a short time now next is fish again the very first step what the fish will do it will lay eggs okay see here are the eggs a fish lay thousands of eggs at one time in water the eggs of fish do not have shells so see they are not having shells only a few of them develop into baby fish and only few of the baby fish survive because many other fishes eat those eggs that's why most of the eggs and baby fishes are eaten up by other big fishes yes the eggs are not having the protective covering they are not having the egg shell right so kya ho jata hai dusre fish bhi unko kha jate hai and that is why only few eggs convert into a fish then this process we know egg baby fish then baby fish grows and becomes an adult fish now the next one is reptiles reptiles like lizards turtles and snakes lay their eggs on the ground or holes in the ground because they live in grounds they do not sit on the eggs to keep them warm like birds used to do and that process is known as incubation when a bird sit on egg to provide warm to the eggs this process is called incubation but snakes lizards reptiles aisa nahi karte the eggs are warmed by the heat of the sun they are warmed by the heat of the sun not by the mother they are not protected by their parents yes they are not protected many of the eggs are eaten by other animals because there is no one to protect them so they are eaten by other animals now see children now what is your homework for today your homework for today is to solve these mcq 
okay see the yellow substance present inside the bird's egg is called dash the eggs of the reptiles are warmed by the heat of the dash and i have underlined it here okay you will be able to solve it okay children bye bye take care may god bless you